Hello, welcome to another Tips and Tricks Tuesday with Lynn Allen. I am actually on vacation today. I'm in Kauai. Don't hate me. I get to go on vacation too. Um, but I do want to warn you, there's a, a rooster outside that continues to crow, so you might hear him in the background like I'm on a farm. Anyway, today we're going to talk about a tip that I just ran into a couple of weeks ago. I think it's really, really valuable. If you do a lot of work with XREFs, we know how to go into the XREF manager. I'll just go into it really quickly and I can check and see that I have two attached XREFs on here. That's easy. I can see I have two different drawings attached in here. But have you ever wanted to go the other way around? Have you ever had a drawing file that you wanted to know where is this drawing file referenced in all of my draw you know, with all of my drawings? Is it referenced in one of their drawings? Is it referenced in a hundred drawings? If I make a change to that drawing, I need to know what other drawings are going to be impacted. Hopefully that makes sense to you. Let me just close up my XREF manager there. So I can tell you. You can do this in a program called The Vault, which is free to all subscription members. There's a really cool command called Where Used. And I was like, why can't we just do this inside of AutoCAD? Well, you can do it inside of AutoCAD by checking out Design Center. I'm going to do a Control 2 to go into Design Center. And uh, there is this really cool search tool. I'm going to grab the search tool and look at all the different things that you can search for in a multitude of drawings. You can search for blocks by a specific name, you can search for specific layers, but the key here, the really powerful one that I'm so excited about is XREFs. So, I happen to have a drawing called the Wine Cellar. Of course I do, right? <laughs> I live near Napa, so of course we have to have a drawing called the Wine Cellar. And I am, want to make some changes to the wine cellar. But before I do that, I want to see which drawings are are it is it which drawings is this file referenced into. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to do a search. Oh, found it right away. It tells me right there. It pretty much uh, searched the directory that I had at the top, which is where I happen to be keeping all of my current current drawing files. And you'll see that it found it. it's referenced one time. Um, inside this particular drawing called Expo. So that lets me know that if I make a change to the drawing wine cellar that at least one drawing, one other drawing is going to be impacted as well. See, I think that is very, very powerful. You would, of course, have it search all of the directories that you need it to, to take a look at. It can look at your entire hard drive if you want. I will warn you, that will take a while. That's why I had it just search one particular directory so I didn't bore you too much. But very, very powerful feature. So that is my tip for uh, this particular Tuesday. I hope you guys have a great rest of the week and I'll see you in a couple of weeks.